Today's going to be a fun video because we're going to talk about the movie Romeo and Juliet. Okay, I haven't seen that movie until last month. And I didn't see the weird one, the Leo DiCaprio one. I saw the one with, like, the two teenagers, Leonard Whiting and Olivia Hussey. Okay, let's talk about it. Okay, I know it's one of the most tragic love stories of all time. And it made me cry because I'm an emotional human being. And it's just weird for two families to just fight. They never gave us a reason why they why they hated each other so much. They never did. I know, that's, that's what's dumb about it. And like, but since you, probably most of you haven't seen that movie, I will tell you most about it. Spoiler alert, all right? But I get spoilers a lot, so it's not a big deal for me. Um, well, it turns out to... Families are fighting each other, as we all know, are the Montagues and Capulets. The Montagues is the family Romeo comes from, and the Capulets are the family Juliet comes from. So, um, Romeo is recovering from rejection, as I have dealt with five times. And it's not fun. And... Well, he goes to a party where he meets Juliet, the Capulet's daughter, the Capulet's 13-year-old daughter. And Romeo is 16, by the way. So, anyway, they meet each other, confess their love, and then kiss. And then Re Romeo realizes that Juliet is a Capulet. But he talks to her in the garden, which is the most longest scene in that movie, and... They discuss about getting married, and then they get married the following day. But then, conflicts happen. Romeo kills Juliet's cousin Tybalt because they fight because they're enemy families. But he refuses to fight him at first since he's been married to Juliet. And, and it is a really good movie. It's also sad. Juliet goes to Friar Lawrence because to come to not get married to Paris, so Friar Lawrence gives her the potion and the knife to prevent her from doing that. So she drinks the potion, falls into a sleep for like 42 hours. And people think she's dead, so they bury her in the family crypt and Romeo goes to see her. And he cries and and he kisses her, and he drinks the potion, and he, and then he dies. And then Juliet wakes up and then sees Romeo dead. She tries to drink the poison, and she kisses Romeo. Then she cries, but then she kills herself with Romeo's dagger, stabbing herself in the heart. And then the Montagues and Capulets re reconcile after their children's deaths. For never was a story of Mo'o than this of Juliet and her Romeo.